Touch of Jazz. You're listening to In Touch Radio. Welcome to the DLD Motivational Moment. Hi, I'm Donald L. Dowers Jr., your motivational guru. This is the Motivational Moment. Small-minded thing. This is not a blue light special. Oh, no. This is a red light throbbing straight to the bladder. You better be aware of the uncouth individual. They're constantly applying the ghetto mission to deconstruct any and all. Just to stand erect. Don't worry if this shoe don't fit. Walk on by. Watch your 180 eye span. This is a message to be aware of those who are tainted. An enemy of enriched, small-minded people. This has been the DLD Motivational Moment. Pre-order my new book, Motivational Moments, at DLD28-2002 at Yahoo.com or 813-394-5875. There we go. Hey! Yeah. Let play just a minute. Let just, 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 just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Hey! 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 Ain't nobody stopping my shine. Ain't nobody stopping my shine. <laughs> okay. Good morning, everybody. Y'all, listen. Look, we're picking it back up right here, live, right here yes. in In Touch Studio. It's going down. Coach May, what's going on? What's going on, Dr. V? Listen, it feel good to be on this side of the board. <laughs> wow. She, she hung you out there to dry today, didn't she? She came in starting this morning, didn't she, Daryl? Listen, she it came feels in good. Shooting Listen, bullets. y'all, let me tell y'all something. Never mind cutting. She's shooting. Listen, <laughs> I am getting ready to be 53 this year, right? I'm getting ready to be 53. And, you know, it takes a little more. For me to multitask than it used to take, right? Now, I, that's I'm not. That's not my greatest strength, you know. Right. But you put me over here. Let me just talk on the mic. Let's just relax. Do your testing, thing. Testing, testing. Yes. One, two, three. Testing. That's testing. it. That's it. I'm all right. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> so thank you, Daryl. I appreciate you. See, you see that? You see that? Right? She she put you out there. She put you out there. <laughs> Coach May, how you doing? Boo? I'm doing outstanding this morning. Um, it's it, it's been a uh, a very good week, uh, very busy weekend. Like yes. you said, you know, my nephew, um, he flew in from Ghana. You know, uh, he flew that's the one that watches the show he, he, he over watches in the show. Africa. Yeah, he watches yes. the show from Africa. Yeah, so he just flew in. Uh, he flew in the other day. Uh, and, and he's in Tampa. In, yeah, he's in Tampa. Yeah, you should have brought him to the studio. Oh man, it's too early for him. <laughs> oh my it's goodness. Yeah, him. plus the time so, difference. Yeah, so yeah, he's still he's, probably adjusting oh, to yeah, the time difference. Um, he doesn't. Um, he he doesn't have to get up early anymore. You know, he doesn't. You know, he spent many, like myself, years in the military. And, okay. And he's done now. That, okay. That getting up early, he doesn't have to. He's, 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 he's good on nah, that. Nah, anybody with a pet monkey, they don't have to get up early. He, he got a pet monkey? I'm just going to leave it right there. He got a, is his name Michael Jackson? Uh, no, that's what I said. When, when all of us, I said, look at Michael. I said, look at Michael. <laughs> I said, look at Michael. He got a pet monkey. He has a pet monkey. He has a pet, uh, quite a few pets. He has um, some scorpions. Uh, he brought them with him? No, no, no. They're, they're back. They're back in oh, his I compound. Ready to back say. There, yeah. At his compound? Yeah, his compound. Yes. That's what I'm... See, dear, that's yes. what I'm trying to have, a compound. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. With security and everything. Yes. You can't just roll up. No, Don't no, roll you, up on you're me. You're definitely not going to do that. We're not doing no not drive-bys, drop-up. You know, no, no, no. You, no, you, no. no. Yeah, he don't need the security. He'll knock you off himself. Excuse me. That's what it is. Okay. That's See, why we, you know, That's that military background. That's it. That's it. We'll yeah. take care of that. We'll take oh, care that's of that. amazing. Yeah. Seriously though, he's I do guy. want to compound. Very good guy. Very good guy. Very uh, he's he's in and um like you said, you were talking about uh uh seafood uh buffet. Mm-hmm. Man, look here. My man, his mom put down my mom put down uh shrimp. Uh she put down a uh, um a shrimp boil. Um, shrimp, he some corn, crab potato. In it. No, no, she ain't put the she ain't do the okay. crab. Um, he's allergic to crab, but uh, oh, okay. She did all that fish, uh, chicken. We had you name it. We had it. That we sound like it. my house. Man, we were. We, I yeah, need to. You know what? I Let's, need to call you know, my we gotta husband. call Mr. Rick. That's what yeah. I'm saying. We need to go ahead and hook yeah, him up. Yeah, he need to come on and 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 do something. Yeah, we now. need to do that. Throw, throw some grits do up some, on that thing. Some some some, some 
Don't about. start with the grits. Da- Je- see, Ms. that's Darryl, why Ms. you Darryl. can't. Let me tell y'all something about black people. Let me tell you something about them. <laughs> so you give them an inch, they yeah. want to take a out. Now, see, he didn't have to bring the grits up. That's bringing no, up just, old stuff. But I'm he just, messy just, like that. Just, Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He messy like that. That's that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just messy. had, you know, I was just saying. Okay, you know, fishing, I just wanted to go a, on record and saying that. Ain't like fish and grits. Dr. Don't v, do that. Some I'm, shrimp and grits. Okay. Some shrimp and grits. Because I didn't fix no grits when I fixed breakfast. Dr. V. You ain't always got to fix no grits. Dr. V. All I'm saying is that, you know, I'm, we're not even going eggs. back there. We're not even going back there. You know, you're talking we're about not. cooking. You know, not just, you got to get there. Mr. That's Rick. Mr. Rick can fix the so, grits. tell me, how was your week other than that? <laughs> My week was great, Dr. V. <laughs> How about yours? How about yours, Dr. Listen, v? my week was amazing. So, yes. so let me tell you, yeah. like yesterday, I ended up going to um, Delphi Academy's graduation. Delphi is in um, Clearwater. Okay. And um, Delphi is um, it's, it's a different kind of, uh, of school. And they had two graduates. It's not bad. You know, I felt better. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Because yes. they've been in existence since 83. Right. They had two graduates, and they had their first female graduate. That's what I'm talking about right there. Right? So about. that was huge. I was right. able to be a part of history. They asked me to come. They had special seating for me up front. Right, right. Um, the young women. I'd gone there, um, not this year, but last year, and spoke to the students about entrepreneurship and right. just, you know, getting their mind right and everything. And so I got an opportunity to get up and celebrate them. They played Dancing Queen, and they wanted people to get up and what dance with say? them. You know, people weren't moving Dancing like that. Who queen. got up first? You know you did. Me? You know you did. That's why you tired this morning. Listen, I did turn up all I know day you did. yesterday. I know like, you did. So from there, I went. I did a financial uh, literacy workshop. I did Money Matters okay. at um, at Well Pavilion, now Legacy Church. Uh, Sydney okay. Turner sponsored it. I okay. talked about um, legacy planning. And just the things that I do in, in helping people to build their legacy and put together their legacy and stuff. So I was able to do that. Right. Then, oh, hold, hold on. Along. Then I went to Shop and Sip. Oh, she went Listen, to let me tell you sip. something. You, this is why I hate going and being a vendor at places. Right. Because they want to bring out all these clothes and, and jewelry yes. and all of this yes. stuff. Why? Listen, I'm trying to make not money, not spend money. Come on now. But listen, they had everything set. And this one pulls out this yellow dress. Uh-oh. I said... It was over, huh? It was over. Everybody was looking at that dress. Was it was it canary yellow? It was canary yellow. See that right there? That right there. I said, <laughs> Daryl, you. Oh my God! She finna go I there. said this dress is bad. No, she she finna go there. But I did not get it. What? I didn't get it. What? I said, let me wait. I got no. her card. I said, let me wait. Let me wait. Just... And then I left and I went shopping. See right there. But you know, when you have those private shopping sessions. <laughs> right there. See? see? Yeah. See, right there. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. Dale had to pull out a picture of his daughter in her yellow dress. He's trying to make me go get a yellow see? dress. See? <laughs> yes. Girl, got that, boy. You know that yellow be looking good. He pulled good. that up, boy. He pulled that right on up. He did. He pulled that right on up. She must have just had that on recently. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, the shopping ship was good. Then I got a chance to go shopping. Right. Again, like that's a private stre- shopping that's session. Stre- that's that stretch. Believe them. Well, this is what this is what I've done. I've learned how to partner with people. Okay. So I've learned how to partner with people so I don't end up spending a lot of money. Right. But let me tell you what I've noticed. Every time I'm ready for a shift, yes. like God will open the door okay. for a wardrobe change. All right. Like literally. Like I'm talking about so serious, so serious. So I was able to get clothes and jewelry and all the shoes. I'm talking about everything, baby. Don't play with my right, God. Right, right. He know how to work it out. Right. And so I was able to shop, and, and and I went home. I had so much stuff, but I didn't get home till after midnight. Right. It's after midnight. Yeah, you were out there, Something huh? You were a thriller, huh? In the you were a thriller, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So it was good. It was good. It was good. So you all are getting to see, you know, some of my purchase. Listen, yes, yes. my little jewelry set, the dress. Oh, you know, she had, to, she had to come with it today. I had, had to come, come with it. it. Yeah, I had to come yes. with it. Absolutely, absolutely. Yes. Good, so it good. was good, though. It was good. And and then today, of course, is Pentecost. Okay. Pentecost, the time when the Holy Spirit descended. Um, they were in one room. Yes. Um. In the upper room, on one accord, the waiting. Upper the upper room. Yes. The upper room. The upper room. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they were on one accord, and the right. Spirit of God uh, descended in the form of the Holy Spirit. And 
that is when the comforter truly came wow. to comfort us. Wow. So it was it's an amazing day. And so one of the things that I've noticed about Pentecost season, yes. because I want you to think about it, there's Pentecost and there's Juneteenth. They're okay. all right there together, right? Right. right. So right. before freedom comes one accord. Right. Say that again. Say that right there. Before again. freedom comes one accord. All right. Right. Before so yes, the, so the Pentecost comes. Right. right. The Holy Spirit descends, wow. and then there is freedom. Okay. Right. So they they're right there together. Right. And I was talking to someone about it, and I said, you know, it's funny to me because you have to pay attention to your life. Pay right. attention to your life. Right. Pay attention to your life. Now I'm from Kentucky, so we don't celebrate Juneteenth. We celebrate Eighth of August. Why? We found out we were free later. Okay. It was August by the time we found out that we yes. were free. <laughs> My folks were still serving on the plantation <laughs> in June. You know why they waited See, Right now, I knew August. he was coming. I knew he was coming. <laughs> why they waited? They was drinking that Kentucky That's bourbon. It. That Kentucky <laughs> bourbon. That's it. <laughs> they still oh, had they, a hangover. They came through there to let them know. Yes. June 19th, y'all free. That's it. They were celebrating. They was, yeah. <laughs> no, listen. They so, had been so, drinking. So, yes. no, so listen, yes. though. Seriously, though. Kentucky was one of the last <laughs> states where slavery and the selling of slaves ended. Okay. One of the last states. So when people say Kentucky is not the South, I tell them that is a lie from the pits of hell. Yes. Because in Lexington, Kentucky, at Cheapside, they were still selling slaves on the block. Cheap. Mm. The cheap slaves. Mm. The, 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 the reject slaves. Yes. So, you know, the re no, for real. <laughs> I, I don't even. What's that? That's the ones that maybe had one good eye. They had a bad leg, okay. you know, but they still, you know, were able to make money from them. Right, they right. just were not the ones that were the good stock. They okay. were not the thoroughbreds. Okay, all right. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So I'll, I'm, I'm, I'm like you, girl. <laughs> 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 I'm like you, girl. Damn, I'm, so I'm lost. So I'm lost, man. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave that one right so, there. So, so I'm 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 law I'm leave that one right there. He shows <laughs> out so bad. What are we gonna do with him, coach? I just, I couldn't even I can't even imagine. I can't. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> so when people talk to me about um Juneteenth, I'm yeah. like, listen, y'all found out sooner than we did. Yeah. Well, like, like I, I agree with Daryl. You know, they knew. You, 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 they did knew. not know. I'm they trying knew. to tell they you. They did not know. That was when they got over that they hangover. They did not they know. They had a month and a half hangover. No, they <laughs> you know did not. They just had first a whole, all, just a whole month. All, Ain't nothing like that. that no. See, before that bourbon, I believe they had that shine. You know what I'm saying? Now, if he had said yeah, shine, right there. if he had said shine, then <laughs> I would have said, said, okay, maybe. Right there. They, but <laughs> not the bourbon. They, they, they were not that, drinking no, the bourbon. No, no, they no, they, they were right, not. They were that shine. Yeah, they were not Ain't drinking the like bourbon. nothing like that good old shine. You know? Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Shine put that real whooping on you. Come on. You know, Come be, on now. You know, your kids don't Come know. On. They, they, they don't. They think drinking they, that hen and that 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 ain't nothing. That, 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 what, is, what is that? That Cavassier, all that, that top shelf Listen, stuff. You get some of that shine. You said Cavassier. <laughs> Listen, let me tell you something. It's a funny story. My mom, when we were living in Georgia, she was in Georgia, and um, it was like it was like the holidays, and she was like, you know, um, he said, you want something to drink? My mom said, yeah, give me some Cavassier. That's it, right? Mom, there. first of all, you can't drink nothing you can't say. <laughs> if you can't say it, you don't need to drink. That's it. it right there. Cavorcier. Cavorcier. But then my mom. I wonder if that comes with a divorce <laughs> with a divorcier. <laughs> Listen, Can I get a Cavorcier, Cavorcier with a Cavorcier? A couple of cheers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Shaking, not stirred. <laughs> but that doesn't oh surprise me because, listen, you guys, <laughs> my mom right makes everything fancy. So, right. you know, my mom, you know, she wanted to be an opera singer. Right. Okay. Right. I love my mom. My mom, she, really? she wanted to be one. She is not oh. one. No. That was wrong. She can sing about right. as good as I can. Yeah. So, no, we can't really sing. Okay. But we love to sing. So, I remember my mom singing Fire and Desire, Rick James and right, Tina right, Marie. Right, 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 So my mom says, <laughs> Love them and leave them. Mama, <laughs> cut it. Stop right there. That's what I used to do. <laughs> use and abuse them. Then I lead always on you. Right Mama, there. no. Right no. There. Right there. Right there. Right there. Yeah, and it was <laughs> for pleasure. Wow. Oh wow. Jesus, Jesus. And 
and I said that right there yes. is why you asked for some Cavorsier. Yeah, right there. It's some Cavorsier. <laughs> <laughs> I said, no, Ma, yes, no, no, yes. no. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's, that's my family. That's it. That's, that's it. That's my family. We may not be able to sing, but we love it. Yeah. And we're going to do it. Like, we're going to do it. We're going to get our sing in. Our <laughs> sing on. Mr. Yes. Darrell, how, uh, how was your week, sir? It was good. It was really, really good. Um, we've had uh, about 7,000 views. Yes, sir. Woo! Yes, yes, keep that up. Keep you that up. Put the applause on. Yeah, yeah. Oh, See, I you can't multitask. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> See, I know, I know. See, I had your back, man. Yeah, yeah. I had your back with the grits. And yeah, then she, right. she, she came back at you, man. Yeah, right. yeah. Yeah, so we had about yeah, 7,000 7, views. views. That's yes, amazing. Yes. Good. So, um, and it's, you know, and it's growing. It, it's it's really, really growing. Okay. Uh, our audience is, is spreading. Awesome. Good, and, good. So we're excited about What's coming? Yes, yes, yes. yes. This is a great season, though. Yes, it is. This is a great season, and Coach, what? I can't wait till March of next year. I'm just, I'm just throwing March out there. Why you throwing March? I'm just doing March, Doctor B. Okay. You know, I'm, you know, I want to be on the SS Minnow, just sailing away. So, speaking of the SS Minnow, I'm looking at cruises for three days. It is. Yeah. Yeah. That's how I like to do. Yeah. I'm looking at cruises. Yes. You know, for. Hey, watch out now. See y'all Not listen. Place. Listen. I'm looking at up. the cruises. I'm Not looking the at the cruises. Place, yes. Yeah, I'm looking yeah, at the cruises. It's good looking. So that we can we can book them. We can book it and and start taking deposits so that we can go on a a, a Dr. V's place cruise. Hey. Yeah. Oh. Hey, hey Miss Daryl, I'm trying yeah. to get a white a white night. A white night. Yes, sir. Why got to be white? <laughs> Cool. Cool. <laughs> Thank you, Doctor V. I appreciate. Why it gotta be white? I, I would rather. Why it can't be a black night? <laughs> it's, 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 it's too hot. It's too hot. Listen, it's Juneteenth. Thank you. You you talking about a white night? A white night. I'm talking about on the ship, Doctor V. Okay. I'm talking about the ship. It's too hot in March, April, May. Man, you saw how hot it was out here. <laughs> <laughs> we were cooking. We were cooking food on the God. table out there. Oh Lord. <laughs> You said the USS Minnow, right? Yes. Okay. Not, not too many That's people. That's Gilligan's ship. Yeah, not too many people. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm not getting on Gilligan's ship. They didn't make it back. They didn't make it back. They had a professor. No. They did not make it back. I did not have time for that. I believe they did make it back. They were just, they, you know, they just well, didn't want to make it back. Do you remember the the uh, <laughs> the uh, the episode where they made it back? And then they wanted to go back. Yeah, yeah, they wanted, yeah, to, go yeah, they wanted to go back. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah they, they enjoyed the island. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All of a sudden, everything had changed. Yeah. You know, it all depends. Nothing on how was we, the you same. Know, go, go, go down to the, the Caribbean. You know, it may be the U.S. Listen, you know. hold on now. Wait a minute. <laughs> now let me tell y'all something. You know, I was talking to a woman who was sitting next to me yesterday right. at the shopping zip, yes. and she's a travel agent. And I said, "Listen, we ain't going to Cuba. Let me tell you where I'm not we ain't going. going to Cuba. The Dominican Republic. Okay." You know, there was a black couple that went missing in the DR right. from New York. Mm-hmm. Listen, I be- y'all, I'm just telling you what I believe. I believe that that couple was set up uh, for organ harvesting. So oh, people right. better yeah. understand yeah. that organ harvesting is real. Yes. That's a real thing. Yes. You know, and, and we want to go to these countries and stuff and just be, listen, don't be just be. out there on them roads and stuff. They were trying to get back to the plane. The but. woman was nervous, too. She felt something. She felt something. She was nervous about the drive to the airport because it was a um, hundred mile drive to the airport from the resort where they were staying. Yeah, see, right there. She was nervous about it. But see, you know, um, the organ harvesting. Um, I've been watching and and hearing about it as well here in the states as well. Oh yes, especially up north and in, um, in the Midwest. Mm-hmm. It's like you know people show up missing, and um, I was reading where the other day they had a gentleman that showed up. He was missing his um his throat. He was missing his throat, um, his heart and his um kidneys. And I'm you know, I'm like, wow, you know, it's amazing how how it's just harvesting is just just is real. And in the South, check yeah. this out. So um remember the boy that was um the high school boy, I think it was in Alabama, Mississippi, mm-hmm. someplace. Where they found him dead under the bleachers. Yeah, yes. stuff yes. with straw. Yes. Yeah. And then in Kentucky, let me talk about Kentucky for a second. There's a rise in the number of um, 
girls and women who are missing. Now, I believe some of it is sex trafficking, but some uh, of that stuff is organ, is organ organs, harvesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so, so. I, I'm just saying we really have to be aware and we have yes. to be cognizant. Yes. You know that some of this stuff is not just conspiracy theory. This stuff is real. Yes. Yes. This stuff is real, and yeah. we need to be on one accord about not letting people take our organs. I ain't even take my organs. That, you, you know, I take my organs. I don't know. What I wasn't trying to be a downer, to, but let me see. Well, you gotta have you know healthy organs. <laughs> that's what I was saying. You know, that's what I was saying. You know. <laughs> what was that? Then this is the next thing. How do they know your organs are healthy? So let's get back to. No, I'm not going to start. Let me stop. Let me stop. Medical records. Okay. Signing, I'm an organ donor. Mm. I'm going to keep that quiet right okay. there. I'm going to just stop. keep that one quiet. Okay. Keep that one quiet. Yeah. 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 I don't want to I don't want to be missing before I go on a cruise. <laughs> <laughs> you know they already watching me. I'm on the watch list. I know America's most wanted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm on the watch list. Oh my goodness! So, I'm yeah. on the watch list. They listen so, to my conversation. Dr. V, what you mm-hmm. got going this week? What do we have going this week? This week. Yeah. This week. This week. So, oh, oh, oh. Let me tell y'all this amazing right news. See, so I know how to get them. I see. I listen, them. I have. I'm teaching a class called Stress Reduction and Relaxation. Yeah. Oh, you know what? That's that's what we got to talk about. That class right there. That so. class is amazing. Yes. So they come into class and we do meditation. Wait a minute. Are you on I'm the paid. collegiate level? Yeah. Yes. They pay me. When she told me that, when she told me that, I'm like, do they? That's a class they offer like stress yes. reduction and relaxation. Yeah. Let me tell you something. Is it working? You don't know how yes. to relax. That's why I'm teaching the class. <laughs> <laughs> I said, wow, the Lord really knows how to give you what you need, yes, right? Yes. So I go in two days a week. Okay. We start out, we meditate, we breathe, we relax, we visualize. Oh, let me write this down. 15 minutes. 15 minutes. So All that's right. my stress reduction and relaxation. And I get paid to do it. <laughs> so my students are amazing. It's a small class, but we're having an amazing time. We're talking about different techniques and Talk about body scanning, progressive um, relaxation, and all of these different tools and methods that you can use to relax. Talking about breathing, you know, and how we breathe and stuff. So it is serious. And so what I said was, that's something that I need to do for the community. That's something that would be good for the community is to do uh, a stress reduction and relaxation class just so that people can learn how to do it and how to do it effectively. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. You would yeah. come, coach. I'll, I'll be there. Because it doesn't I'll have be. to take a long time. No. no it doesn't I'll be have there. to take a long time. Like, it can happen quickly. Like, it can happen as quickly as you want it oh. to happen. So, it's just a matter of learning the tools and the techniques All right, so, and being able to use so, it. So, then, so, so then what, what would be one of the techniques that we, we would do? Mr. Mr. Daryl and myself, we show, we come to class. What, what's the, why are you looking like that, Dr. V? Like, like what? Like, like, you, like, y'all ain't serious. <laughs> <laughs> what, what would be what would be that thing that we do? Okay, so one of the things that you can do okay. is um, the first thing is you've got to good posture. Okay, make sure that you're sitting up right. Right. The next thing you would do. She's gonna kick you out of class. So I already miss. Because he's yeah, slumping. Yeah, yeah. You see, he look everything. He can't blood. Can't but he relaxed right. though. But he Energy. relaxed. No, no, no. That's not relaxed. See, you see, your body is not able to function right. effectively okay. when you slump, when you're leaning. Like it, it can't. Blood can't flow. Things are not in alignment. Your breath right. doesn't go right. The your, blood your doesn't. Breath, do, your breath doesn't go right. It doesn't go oh, right. Okay. It's not able to produce the energy that it needs to produce the oxygenation that goes into your bloodstream. Okay. That you know all of that. So you have to sit up straight. Okay. The next thing you would do is breathe in through your nose and let your diaphragm. Expand. In other words, make your stomach that bigger. To, that don't need to get any more bigger. But that's why people don't breathe correctly. Mm-hmm. We don't breathe correctly because we don't want our stomach to distend. We don't want our stomach poking out. So we learn to engage in what's known as shallow breathing. <clears throat> we breathe in our chest instead of from our diaphragm. because We don't want our stomach to go out. If you notice babies, when babies first are born, um, babies breathe and their stomachs go up when they breathe in. And they go in when they breathe out. But what happens is something happens, we, something triggers in us, we learn to breathe incorrectly. No one tells us to breathe incorrectly, but something happens and we start breathing incorrectly. Right. 
and we start breathing in and our stomach goes in and we breathe out and our stomach goes out just a little bit, not much. So we don't ever fully dispel or expel the air or fully take in the air. So let's just do the breathing piece. Let's do the breathing piece for just one second. And you guys can do that out there that are listening. Uh, You want to sit with your back straight up, not against the chair, the back of the chair. Sit away from the back of the chair. Let your your gluteus maximus hit the back of the chair, but you sit straight up with your back away from the chair. And make sure that your legs are at a 90-degree angle. So, you know, if you need to lift flat on the floor, 90-degree angle, put your palms face down on your Knees, not on your thighs, but on your knees. And there's a method to all of this, right? And then I want you to take a deep breath in through your nose. Allow your abdomen to extend. In other words, come out. Deep breath in. Hold it. Slowly release through your mouth. Pull your stomach all the way in. Deep breath in. Hold it. Slowly release. Deep breath in. There you go. That's good, Daryl. And then blow out. Can you feel a difference? Yeah, I feel a little dizzy. Yeah, because you're not used to breathing right. (laughs) I was seeing spots. He's talking about he was seeing spots. Listen. I was seeing little people. I saw an angel. Hey, hey, it was me. (laughs) But breathing correctly. It's that Kentucky Cola. See, there you go. There you go. There you go. Showing out. Showing out. But, yeah, breathing, breathing correctly, that's a way that we can begin to relax. Because guess what happens? Anytime we're in a crisis situation or a stressful situation, the first thing that we do is we stop breathing. Right. Right. So you want to make sure that you breathe. Right. Okay. Good. 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 So now that we learn to breathe, Mr. Daryl, you know I was I was beginning to want. You know you can't do that with bad breath. Listen, you don't want to do that with someone in front of you with bad breath. Yes. Yes. That's why Listen. I had put a mint in. I had brushed my teeth and put a mint in. Carry hey, some mouthwash you know, see, with you. See, mm. You see, you see, people. You know, let me tell you about family. What? Let me tell you about family. You see, you got your people over there saying that works. Uh, you, you know, uh-huh, yeah. Uh-huh. People, but I got my people over here on my side. What they talking saying? about? So that's how you know you're old if you're seeing spots. See, <laughs> right there. Listen, we're not going right to talk about that. We're not going to talk saying? about that. We, Yo, la- gonna... When was the last time he? When was the last time he relaxed? <laughs> Listen, you know? mm-hmm. right. Here. <laughs> that's not age. That's that's not age. No, I'm getting out, I'm age. getting out those bad spots from you. Mm, <laughs> it is. Mm, mm. <laughs> Listen, all I know is this. This is what I know. I know that that breathing yes. makes a difference. It allows your body to begin to relax, right? And, yes. and get the and it takes a while to get accustomed to it because it will cause you to be lightheaded because you're not used to breathing right correctly. Right. So your body has to readjust to the way it's supposed to function. Good to go. Good so to breathing go. is one of the ways. Good. You all, listen, Coach, we got five minutes. Wow, great show. It was fun. I loved this show this morning. It was a relaxing show. It was great. Was it, it was relaxing, great. Coach? It was relaxing. You it must was be relaxing. that stress, rest, that breathing. Re- relaxation. That was breathing, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Of course. Now, I got a question. Took. Now, uh, speaking of relaxation, now, um, can you relax? Because I see a lot of, it, it seems like it's coming back in style with kids with their pants down around their knees and ankles. Is, 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 is that relax? You know, is that is that a... Listen, if they knew what I know, yes, they pull the pants up. Well, you because you can't run with your pants down like you know, that. No, you can't. And 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 the police police here loves that. They oh love yeah, that. oh yeah, that's their that. biggest tool. Yes, that's their yes. biggest tool for yes. catching people. Yes, you yes. know, yes. you helping them catch you. <laughs> you helping them. <laughs> we, you know, they like yeah, keep hey, your what, pants what's down. What's that word? There's a word about that. It says, we we perish for well, a lack, lack of, of knowledge. knowledge. <laughs> Huh. Yes, you yes. can't even be a good criminal sagging. Uh, see right that's there. not that's right not there. productive right to your there. criminal <laughs> life. If you want to be a criminal, don't sag. That's it. That's that's the that's moral it. of the story. <laughs> <laughs> don't sag because you it. will be caught. Huh. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, Dr. V, we got about we got about three minutes. Three minutes, yes. Coach. This week, this week, this week, this week, this week. What you want to leave the people with? Oh my goodness, uh, this week to uh, get them through this the the rest of uh, the week. Cause today is day one of the week. Wow, we are uh, you know kids are out of school now. Kids Listen. are out of school and they are eating. They are everybody out of house and home. Oh my god! Find a free lunch program. Yes. 
Listen. Find a free lunch. Listen, find your nearest school, free lunch program. The, the city of Tampa parks and recs. <laughs> yes. are feeding them. Yes. Oh, speaking of, come on. Um, my family out in uh, uh, Carver City, uh, they are feeding. Um, they're feeding Conan's Barbecue, twelve until they finish. Um, they you can go there and get free food. Anything they have is when free is today. What today? Anything they have? What free barbecue, ribs, chicken, sausage. Baked beans, collard green, mac and cheese. Where is that at? Uh, give give us the City. address. Carver City uh, is on Lois. You get off on Lois. Uh, yes. Uh, make a, you make a, a right on Lois, a left on Cypress. Cypress, and then go back and to a right on Hubert. Hubert, yes. It's right there. Hubert and uh, just, that'll be almost Nassau. It's, in, it's after Nassau. Yeah. And what's the name of it? Conan's Barbecue. I think the address Barbecue. is like, it's okay. in the 1500 block, I believe. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Y'all Barbecue. heard it from 12 until it's gone. Until it's gone. So you better get there quick because I promise you Let the line you will be out the door. I'm glad you told me that. Yes. They do that. They try to do it at least once or twice a month. Yeah. Um, and they, wow. Yeah, they, they do that. They, they're giving back to the community. That's so, good. Yes. That's good. Yes. That's good. Good food. Oh, yeah. Good food oh, yeah. being given back. Yes. I love yes. it. Thank you for sharing that. Listen, you guys, this week, you know, I want to I want to leave you guys with this thought, right? You've got to examine for yourself what true freedom is. Is. Yes. And true freedom comes from being on one accord with the Spirit of God. And as you become on one accord with the Spirit of God, he will lead you into all knowledge, understanding, and you'll be able to move as he directs you. Make sure you allow him to guide you. Step into the freedom that God has already provided because I promise you um, there is power in that freedom. Um, don't get sidetracked. Don't get side um focused, yes. you know, but make sure that you focus on the will of God for your life and um, keep going. That'd don't be. quit. Now, V, just touch that, what you just said, um, freedom, and, and and stepping into it. Know that freedom does cost. It costs. It costs. It does. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ had to pay the price. Yes. And and we have to work to to, to, to get Absolutely. out to make sure and we maintain that. And it's not comfortable. That. No, it's not. It's never freedom comfortable. Freedom is not comfortable. Oh, but no. Harriet Tubman said it best yes. when she said, when they asked her, how many slaves did she free? How does she feel about freeing the number of slaves that she freed? She said, you know, I could have freed more if they'd known yes. they were slaves. If they were known they were slaves. Mm. Mm. My God. Today, yes. find your Remember slavery, that. your That's slave it. station, your That's slave it. space. Yes. Get free, you know? That's it. That's so, it. freedom is yours. You guys, listen, we love you to yes. life and life, life more, more abundant. abundant. Yes. You guys, be blessed. Yes. Mwah. Stop the